L A D ladies A and G E gentlemen T H I this is Jason Becker T H E the S E X sexiest M A man alive There was nobody better than that dude he was on another level. When people would hear him, they'd turn their head and go, what the heck was that? But he wouldn't just play a Bach piece. He could set a guitar on his lap and play it that way. Jason was on his way to becoming a really big rock star. He was going to just take over the world. And that's when Jason told us his leg was kind of bothering him. He just had been limping for a while, and we finally talked him into check, getting it checked out at Kaiser in L.A. when he was there, and that's when all the trouble started. We believe you've got Lou Gehrig's disease and you have three to five years to live. I think his answer was, am I going to be able to tour? Eventually he needed crutches, then a wheelchair. Then it just got to where, you know, he dropped the guitar, he couldn't even hang on to it. When he was really sick, he was really thin and really pale. It was a different person. It never surprised me that if there was a way to keep making music, he would. His mind frame was, well, no, I just I have stuff to do. So I just have to go do it. And so we created a, a system uh, to allow Jason to be able, using just his chin, sort of one click at a time, to be able to enter in the notes. God, he just kept working. It happened so young, and he just still had a life to live, and he wanted to live it. That's when I invented the sign language for him. Basically, it's an eye geometry. Every letter of the alphabet has two eye movements. I remember I came to his house, and he played this thing for me, and I went, how did you do this? I was just floored. still here.